Presenting the Tau Series 9. Every bolt, every component has been meticulously designed. Are your legs expensive? Because they look pretty expensive. Tau will obey any command. It lives to serve. Tell me the three elves on the front of the Rice Krispie box. Snap, crackle, and... Tau features convenient transport handles. Please keep your temper. I don't have a temper. And is built from impact resistant materials. What are the five fingers say to the face? Slap! Trouble free service is guaranteed by our Robo Recall program. These things have safety, because I don't think they have safety. Making your life better, one robot at a time. Be glad you still have your arms, because I collect those. Robo Recall! Say it again! Say it again for the folks in the back! Robo Recall! The game where the robots are red, the drones are blue, and every single one of them is out to kill you. Your legs are red, your torso is blue. Don't interrupt me! You ruin the poll! Starting us off, massive shout out to the people at Oculus for not only sponsoring today's video, not only sending me an Oculus Rift S, but most importantly, providing me with a blast of an experience. Mom said it's my turn to get off the Xbox. <laughs> Don't glue! It has been so much fun, I basically can't put this thing down. How tall are you, Cosmo Bubbles? Yeah. <laughs> my son! <laughs> oh my Don't God. speak to me or my son ever again. <laughs> so if you'd like to check out the Oculus Rift S, I'll be sure to leave a link down below that's easy to click on and diving into the details here. A box arrived from Oculus, which I've placed next to Flork's sock puppet for scale. Inside the box was a headset with a single cable that ended in a display port and a USB. Two Oculus Rift touch controllers, which I religiously wore with wrist straps on to make sure I didn't break shit around my apartment. And a little cardboard box with a manual slash batteries slash adapter that was wasn't needed for my setup. Now I know you may be thinking, what about tracking sensors? That is where the Oculus Rift S really shines, because instead of having to set up sensors around your room, it uses something called inside out tracking, where sensors are built in on the headset itself for fewer wires and maximum convenience. After a quick firmware update, tutorial, and setup of my boundaries that made sure I didn't accidentally break shit in real life, I was ready for Robo Recall. Robo Recall! Welcome to the technological advanced future, where humans and robots peacefully coexist until one day, they don't. I'm a toaster, I swear. Don't look at me like that, you big dumb- Switch is where you come in, as Agent 34, a robo-ready recall specialist in charge of, well, recalling the robots. Isn't it blatantly obvious? Robo Recall! Thankfully, you're not alone, because you're trioed with Dolores, an informative and helpful shot caller. My name is Dolores, and I'm your artificial intelligence deputy. I'm here to help you excel at RoboReady. And the one, the only, the bombastic Philip, the positivity spewing hype man that's your own brainless motivator. Are you receiving transmissions from an AI calling itself Philip? Yes. Please disregard anything this AI says. Really fire! Robo Ready should promote you to ruler of the universe! You're having a blast! With these two virtual beings by your virtual side, you'll be defending relays that eradicate entire blocks of robots, recalling robots in a timed frenzy, collecting robots like the trash man you are, and why am I wording it this way? You're just murdering scores of robots and yeeting them around. This is all semantics. Talk about breaking a leg, am I right? The trash business is a gold mine! On this crusade against the robots, you have a tremendous amount of creativity in your hands, and that happens to be where we're gonna start when it comes to combat. Your hands. Let's give them a hand! Your hands are capable of incredible feats, like ripping off a robot's leg and using it as a lethal weapon. Right now! Stop hitting yourself! Stop hitting yourself! And let's say he's not dead over there, I can still take the same look. Stop interrupting! Oh, Anything with a white circle can not only be grabbed and torn, but targeted and shot. So again, this creativity component is deeper than it seems. Uh, that's mine now. Come here, buddy. I'll take that, and let's play the game called Is the Safety On? Nope. And bang, 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 yeet. Dodge and grab bullets out of midair, Neo style, and send them back to where they came from. I'll take that. What is this, a 45? Catch, buddy! You can even punch and slap your way through entire levels, so no matter how low you want to stoop on the barbaric totem pole, it's all on the menu. My best. 
Christ. How about my fist? Your fist! Hey, robot, you got a pretty mouth. I am a one-punch man. Butterbean with a crushing right jab, and the crowd goes wild. Well, you're right, buddy. I'll give you a second to catch your breath. Just kidding. Pistol secondaries are the next escalation in force, and in my opinion, the most satisfying weapons in the whole game. Eddie, think I'll be more accurate if I fire it like this? And I've never, ever seen a better reload mechanic in my entire life. Ugh, fee fa fo fum do I ever think reloading is dumb. All right, this is such a meme. Basically, the way that you reload guns is not by swapping out the mags. This is not at all environmentally friendly, but it's awesome. So imagine if I'm done shooting all of these bullets, like both of my mags are empty. I don't reload by swapping out the mags. I just physically drop the guns and there's already two more reloaded on my hip. So I never get new magazines, I always get new guns. This is ridiculous. Accuracy doesn't matter when your bullets are bottomless. Shotgun primaries because there's no such thing as too much stopping power. These are my boomsticks. It was with these boomsticks that I learned the importance of teleportation that not only allows you to select where you leap, but what what direction you're facing when you arrive. That way, you're never out of shotgun range. Uh -huh, I'm skipping a jump. I was over there, now I'm over here. Hey, robot, you got games on your phone? This is just cheating. Aw, oh, buddy, are you out of guns? Boy, did I ever need this ability to think with portals, especially with the shielded elite looking dudes near the end of the game. It was their kryptonite. Hey, eat this, you creep. And nothing personnel, kid. Oh, shit, finger guns. Oh, I got him. I got him. You'll really need this once you face off against the man, or rather AI, behind all of this robo hysteria to exterminate mankind, who is a sentient meme spewing mastermind. In Master Station, Robo AI appears to have achieved sentience. I am sentient. He calls himself Odin. Odin. From the Spanish, Woden, meaning skips lunch on Wednesdays. Do you wonder how it happened? Not really. The internet. <laughs> Cat pictures. Hashtags. Memes. The only way to stop the painfully dead memes is to put his reign to an end via what mailmen like to call return to sender. I'm gonna go ahead and give you these two back. <laughs> may flee several times after being beaten, but he sends his best guys in response like runner robots that disable your teleport. Agent 34, that fast robot has a tether which will prevent you from teleporting. Flying robots with rocket launchers on their backs. Those flying robots have rocket launchers. Watch out. Even a giant Goliath robot the size of a car that I call Kevin is dispatched to crush you. Look out, Agent. Incoming. This isn't meant to instigate fear, it's meant to instigate freedom, because everything that's designed to kill you can be deflected right back into the enemy's face for maximum destruction. Yo! Hey, come here, come here. Let me grab let me grab and give you some of your own medicine. Yes! What's that you say? The scariest enemy in the game? I think you mean. Great. Portable M32 rotary grenade launcher. Yup! Boom, baby! Explosion. Yes! Wow! Will you look at that? Will you look at that? The runner seems to be the best weapon of all. The only robot that I ever felt bad about killing and hijacking is Kevin. There was just something about this one voice line he had that reminded me of what the dreadnought says upon death, and it was just too much. I had a Life. Oh my god, what have I done? These robots are malicious. They're just being controlled by a malicious AI. Did I beat the game or did the game beat me? I'll miss you forever. I'm so sorry. I'll never forget you, Kevin. A duty honorably discharged. So I figured that I owe it to Kevin to stop the monster behind this spiteful agenda once and for all. We're in the end game now. It's time. Agent 34, I have to confess, I lied to you. Dolores? What are you doing here? The truth is, there is no Dolores. There is only That's why Dolores isn't that into me. She's a Norse god. You see, there is only one AI in the world who can stop my new internet. And that is Philip. Don't worry.
worry, Gavin Jr. I'm gonna kill out and get and you out of here. All right, thumbs up. You. Huh? Little th th no. You. Thumbs up, please. Don't worry about the plot or spoilers because it's like a four-hour game and it's about killing robots, not storytelling. So forget about you it. You know this doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but let's go with it. Now I will delete you both like an embarrassing tweet. <laughs> So I slapped his shit, brought the dead memes to an end, and freed all the Kevins all around the world. Your argument is invalid? What is that, like 2009? Agent 34, you saved everything, especially me and Kevin all around the world. But the fun didn't stop just because I crushed Odin's reign of terror. I also got to go back and ball out inside to Wallace. Wallace jars off the rim. Wallace fades back. Wallace bricks. Wallace goes up one more time. It is good. He's also dead. No I admired the billboards that can only be described as concerning. What? 401ks are for losers. Your face needs help. These nuts. These nuts! And overall, polished my slang skills for top tier style points. I'm gonna whack, I'm gonna bounce, reload, bang, bang, bang. And up 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 and down he goes. Don't forget to upgrade your Glocks to full auto, AKA full freedom, because if you don't use select fire, then the robots win. Ah! Ah! Okay, I'm done. Do it to him one more time. Robo Recall! Oh shit, my robot, that's a five star game right there. No R words will ever eclipse Robo Recall in my brain from this point forward. Red, Romeo, Robin, Rude, none of them even come close to the hardest R word of them all. Robo Recall! Thank you so much to Oculus for not only sending me a free Oculus Rift S and sponsoring the video, but also giving me Robo Recall for free. Don't worry, I'm not gonna play the sound. I already played it. Robo Recall! Ah, got you that time. But once again, thank you to everybody at Oculus for letting me take part in this. It has been a wonderful experience, and I appreciate you. Don't forget about the link down below if you want to do all of this Oculus Rift stuff at your own house. And be sure to tune in next time when we feel feverishly discuss if robots have rights.